Hi guys, I'm Andy Guy for the Andy Guy Show here. I'm going to unbox a Big Mac. And uh, I've seen a lot of unboxing movies lately on YouTube, so I figured I would take the time and shoot one for anybody who's never had a Big Mac. So first, you can see McDonald's has folded the bag for us, kind of sealing the heat. We got fries. Now this is not a full container of fries, on the way home, I had a couple of fries. So I know that kind of speaks to my credibility. I'm sorry. Uh, normally, I wouldn't do something like that. But, you know, hunger gets the best of all of us. So, keep going in. This is what the Big Mac comes in. It comes in a box. Um, it's, uh, you can see, is uh, the, the Big Mac essentially is two all-beef pat patties. Sorry. I get really excited. Two all beef patties, special sauce on a poppy seed bun. Um, but there's, there's nutritional facts on the back. Um, there's some kind of nice little uh, spices or herbs. And then uh, here is the slogan. Onions, uh, two all beef patties, cheese, and then lettuce. Uh, special sauce here, pickles, which I got mine without pickles. The stock from the factory, they come with pickles on. I don't like pickles on a burger. I think they don't belong. So, I mean, it's really, it's really, it's up to you. So, <clears throat> opening this, and this is kind of cool because once you've opened this, you can put french fries or ketchup in this side. That's kind of what I do. If I'm really hungry and I'm having like a four piece uh, chicken nuggets with it, sometimes I'll put like honey or honey mustard in here. And then it just, it kind of serves as like a nice tray too for it. So uh, I'm left handed, so my drink is always on my left. Um, fries, like I said, I mean, it's, it doesn't get any more convenient than that. You just kind of pour it out in there. Uh, bag works as a garbage bag. You know, that's sweet, so we can save, you know, our stuff and actually put it in a proper waste receptacle. So, uh, I was taught this by my uncle, but every time you eat a, eat a burger or something that's going to spill out, I mean, obviously you can see already there's kind of lettuce in here and some has fallen off. And that happens, you know, it's going to happen with anything that's pretty big. I have pretty big hands, but uh, what I do is I pinch the back so that nothing comes out. And if it does come out, you can just kind of lick attack it like that. And uh, that's just, that's how I go. So first bite, I just go for the center right down, right down this middle, 12 o'clock for you guys watching at home, 12 o'clock. And uh, I just, so right away, I got a bite of everything. I mean, Look how evenly that is. And I just got a bite of the special sauce, the lettuce. I could taste the patties in there, but I mean, it wasn't, they weren't the most predominant taste. I'm tasting a lot of bun, and that's, this is kind of common with the first bite, but you know, you just gotta kind of, kind of wait your way through it. And now there is a little bit of a difference in taste with, uh, not having the pickles in there. And I know that there are pickles in the special sauce anyways, but I just don't like pickles on a burger. So you gotta remember to eat a couple fries to cleanse your palate in between. Sorry, my phone's dying. So, my advice is, you know, if, if you can afford it, go the extra mile and get a Big Mac. Um, a lot of people like dollar menu stuff, and that's great, but for me, like, if I just want to trounce my hunger and be done with it, I'm totally a Big Mac guy. If, uh, if you haven't had a Big Mac, 
Maybe you don't live in America. I would hop on a boat or a plane. Even if you have to stow away and make your way over and get one. Because they're pretty tasty. And ultimately, it's, it's like a $5 investment. I mean, this is like six something after tax. So, I mean, realistically, it's... It's a good way to spend your day.